younger days. So for her second judge, he is an ESL teacher and a fifth grade teacher in Bible and in English before the sixth level also in English. Dr. Mary Pura Bukos. Because I am so much closer to the end. Without the sunlight and warmth, the solar system would be a dark and cold, cold thing, and there would be no life on Earth. Good afternoon, everyone. Do you know who am I? I am the I am planet Neptune. Neptune is the eighth planet from the sun and the fourth largest of the nine planets. It is a giant gas planet which is most likely made up of various ices and rocks. Neptune has thick atmosphere, small rocky cars, and plain frames. It is blue in color, which is a result of a gas called Macy in its atmosphere. In Roman mythology, Neptune is the god of the sea. I am an asteroid. Do you know what an asteroid is? An asteroid is any one of a large number of small solid objects. I am the Earth. The Earth is the first planet in order from the sun. It is special because it is our home. It is exactly the right distance from the sun to receive just the amount of light and heat. I am a giant planet because I am big. I am Saturn and I am very young. I am very young because I am, I am substantially bigger. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, you present him, I am Saturn. Look at me, you know me? What do you know that I'm the nearest planet to Maybe you think that I'm the planet, but I'm just near to the but you're very wrong. I am not wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, I am Mercury. Representing Grade 3 Alpha. Thank you. Good afternoon, everyone. Do you have any idea who am I? If, well, if you don't know me, I'll give you a clue who am I. I am the second planet near the sun. I was representing Comet. Comets are small numbers of the solar system. They are lumps of ice and dust. Most of the time, they are found in the outermost part of the solar system. I'm representing Jupiter. Jupiter is a giant among the other planets. I'm different from other planets because the gravitational pulls out of a nearby star which causes snowball or orc clouds. My date in my axis is 243 Earth days. Okay, so what makes you different from any other planet in the solar system? I am only different from the other planets because I am a dancing, I am a dancing band of moon. Among the planets, I, I have the most number of moons orbiting around it. I'm different from other planets because I'm the fastest to orbit the sun. I can orbit the sun by only 88 Earth days. I rotate on my axis for only 80, or for only three times for every orbit, two orbits around the sun. Thank you. I'm different from other planets in the solar system because even though I'm 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 a combination of of rocks and metals, and I can still move around the sun. Thank you. I am the windiest planet in the solar system, and I am also called the mathematician planet. Thank you. I am only the planet that sustains life. Thank you. I am different from the others because I am a red planet. One year is equal to six, 687 days. And I have two moons, a Phoebus and a Demos. Okay. 
I am different from other planets because I am separate among the other planets. And I have a large family of moon, some as big as planets. Thank you. I am the one who gives off radiant and heat energy. Thank you. Go oh, look at look at Mars. Very red. The sun, very yellow. Very bright. Earth, <laughs> very green. Of course, she be proud of her man. Magna Awards for the Little Miss and Mr. and Miss Solar System. So may I pass all the gold to the Dash for Miss Earth. Benjamin Franklin. I am an American statesman who helped to write the Declaration of Independence. I proved that lightning is a form of electricity by using the very famous and dangerous kite experiment. This led to my discovery of positive and negative electricity. It also led to my development of terms we still use to do. For example, battery, conductor, charge, discharge, and electrician. The lightning rod is one of my inventions along with that. I also organized a very effective coastal system which mapped the Gulf Stream and recognized the Aurora Borealis as an electrical phenomenon. Europa, I am Archimedes, a Greek mathematician. I was born on 287 BC. One of my biggest and greatest discoveries of my life is the principle of buoyancy. One time, I stepped into a bathtub and noticed the water overflowed. That experience led me to the answer of my experiment. So I said, Yuruka, I found it. Are you sure they can beat me? They can't. My expression is still used until now. Yuruka. Greetings, everyone. I am Isaac Newton. Born in January 4, 1643 in Lincolnshire, England. I am the greatest scientist of all time. I am very famous in my discoveries. Even other scientists use in their studies. They are just nothing but second rate, trying hard copycats. Anyway, I discovered the theory of optics. Don't you know that the white light is a combination of different rays? That's why after a rainy daytime, there's always a rainbow. I discovered also the theory of universal gravitation. All things fall downwards because gravity pulls us to the center of the Earth. And I also discovered thermal motion, inertia, acceleration, and many more. Nobody can beat me. I'm the greatest scientist. Ha 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 ha! 